Legendary recap of season two. How was y'all's Pappy's Day? Happy Pappy's Day! <laughs> y'all, I am so ready. Did y'all see our video earlier? If you are listening to us via a podcast, thank you so much for joining. Thank you for listening to our podcast. Please comment. Please like it. Please rate us five stars, girl. I am Shaquasha Realness, and I am stepping in for the Savon experience. Savon, because it's a takeover, girl. So if you are unaware of what the takeover is, the takeover is I come over and I add a little spice of realness to some otherwise a dull ass show. <laughs> Let's keep it real, girl. I give you the unedited, real, true deal responses to the things that I think about and the shit that I think about. So, we are here to talk about Legendary Season 2. And on tonight's episode, we're going to talk about uh, Plastic Fantastic, The Over Ball, and Ice House. Yes, 6, 7, and 8. Mm, just like that. And I got her. I got her cup. I didn't feel like getting a vase tonight, Petty Monster. So I got the cup. Mm-hmm. What did I do today? So earlier I called Miss Savon to make sure we were still doing the show tonight, girl. She was doing some type of face regimen to bring some beauty back because you know she looks a mess. And she was opening up her Father's Day presents. So, you know, girl, it was a cute little moment to talk to her as she opens up her Father's Day presents. And all of that cute stuff. So, I am back and we're ready to get into it. Season 2, Episode 6, Plastic Fin. Fantastic. Now, if you caught our last episode, you know who the judges are. You know who the houses are. I don't have a problem with going over a recap, but I'm not. Mm -mm, I'm not going to do it. Go back and watch the old video. Watch the video from last week. It's in the list. Go watch it, girl. All right. So at this point, some houses have been eliminated. So on the Plastic Fantastic episode, guest judge is Amaya Scott. Bitch, she is my favorite. That bitch is beautiful. Okay. Yes, God. Come on, Cotton. <laughs> on this show, they showcase floor performances for the Money Ball. Oh, we like money. Money. Money ball, it money. Money ball, it money. Money ball, it money. <laughs> mm. Hold up. I forgot to play my song. Do you want to be a legend? A statement? A star? A star? A star? I'm going to have to bring, I'm going to edit it in, girl. Because... I didn't do it right. Legend. Statement. Star. Statement. Star. Statement. Star. Statement. Star. Statement. Star. Statement. Star. Were for the plastic fantastic. Favorite house 
are rich. They are rich. A rich came out as puppet dolls. And Lord, this was so creative. I thought it was really creative. They stayed in character. They kept the movements. Gillette did her shit. She stayed all in character. She did the shit. Walking through. Ah, ah, oh, That's for me, Shaquasha bra. For the second challenge, which was runway, this was really hard for me because I really expected all the houses to, pre to pretty much come through and tear it up. Because runway, like, girl, one thing you know about the queens, girl, they know how to walk. They know how to runway walk, catwalk, sashay, shantay, ariche. She know how to do all that stuff. So I really thought they were going to be in sync. They was going to, like, flow, be fluid. I thought they was going to work it, girl. I was disappointed. I was like, what is... Girl, I don't even do all that shit, and I could runway walk, girl. What's, what's happening? But anyway... House of Balenciaga, they were exempt, but they kept it simple, and they did what? They kept it cute. Kept it simple, and kept it cute. All right? And for me, Gillette and Balenciaga, when they had the whole co competition one-on-one, they ate it. They totally ate it. Ate it up, girl. That's my thought on it. So, you know, y'all, we've got Savon here. And I did ask her to come through so that she can give us her comments, too. Because I want to know, bitch, what? Bitch, bitch, what did you? Oh, I'm looking at the wrong side. Sorry. Bitch, what did you think? <laughs> what you think, girl? What you think happened? Like, what you think? What, what, what was it? Let's bring her in. What did you think, girl? I'm going to move out of the way because I want to be out without you. Well, thank you, Shaquansha. I appreciate it, girl. <laughs> you looking familiar by the eyes tonight and things. Before I get started, you guys, I want you guys to know that I am wearing Liquid Burns lipstick tonight. Uh, and it tingles a little bit so good. This one is called Pisces. It's called Pisces. Um. Uh. <laughs> anyway, I had to come in because this half a girl, you tried it by saying you had to bring some spice to my show and you had to make sure it was interesting. It isn't. You didn't do anything to make it greater or better. You just came and got on my foundation and built. You're welcome. So, um, I hope you guys have your libations ready. I'm having a small libation tonight because I'm not going to be here long. It don't take much to do what I got to do with Shaquansha, girl, because you know she's not as legendary as I am. She's not even a statement or an icon, honey. But you know she's in the works, so we're going to give her that. Anywho, ah! Happy Pappy's Day to everybody, all So, plastic, fantastic. Mm. I'm acting like her sipping. Plastic, fantastic. So, Shaquansha's favorite was Arichi, of course. And... <laughs> but my favorites... First of all, do we have to ask who my favorites are? Girl, wait a minute. Girl, this, this lip gloss and lipstick is real cute, Liquid Burns. However, my hair keeps getting in it. To it. My hair, it moves. My, my hair, hair, yes, it, it moves. moves. Anyway, anyway, let me, let me spell, spell task. task. Um, um, favorite, favorite houses for plastic, fantastic to me. Teachy, 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 duh, girl. I mean, really? really? This, this was, was real quick. quick. There, there was, was there's, there's nothing, nothing more to say. say. Eight all categories. My dream house. Simone Duck Walt for freaking ever. Like, she duck walked forever. Literally. Like, bitch, my 
Molly's, Molly's were tired. Because I was like, ma'am, ma'am, like, do, 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 do. I was like, she went through all of them and she ate them all up. Mm. <laughs> I don't even want no desserts, she said. Ate it. Okay. Second favorite house for me, of course, Balenciaga. Huh. Bitch, mother said, do you want to play with these? Ah, I'm a Bobby's girl in a Bobby's world. Laughing plastic is fantastic. You can break my hair and touch me everywhere. Third, Comme des Garçons. You know I love cars. And the, and the reference, reference was, was so cute, cute for me. me. I mean, I, I wanted a little bit more because you know I like cars. But, but the, the way, way they, they use Tonka for the car, for the basis, for the chassis, I, I just wanted more. more. I wanted so, so much more. But my favorite three, Chichi, 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 Duh, Balenciaga, Aga, Aga, and... <gasps> Those are my favorites. I knew you was gonna be all about Tichi. Tichi, 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 You can be Tichi, but you know what? I really thought that you was gonna be rooting for the house of Balenciaga just because of the name alone, because you're such a brand whore, you know? So I thought that you was gonna be all about the brand. But when you said you was into Tichi, I was like, okay, she's stepping outside the box. She's not being so typical. So, you know, <laughs> predictive. Predictable, excuse me. Try to predictable. Them lips. Predictable. I mean, move on. You're staring in space. Continue. It's your show. All right. Let's move on to the season two, episode seven. Overball. Oh, girl, yeah, you know it. This is that one. Mm. This is that one, girl. Yes. It is. Okay. We're going to talk about it. Too. We are. So let me talk about the first category. My favorite. My favorite um, was Balenciaga and Mother Shannon. When she came out with that bald ass head, I was yes. like, yes, bitch. Yes. Come on, bald head. Yes. Say bald, see, bald headed hoes win. We you do. should be proud of the fact that you got a whole head full of alopecia, girl. You have absolutely no hair. Shannon showed you bald heads win. You should get on here and be bald. Bitch, I'm and bald. be proud. I'm beautiful. Because she came through and ate that. When she took her wig off, and she had that ball head or that mm. ball cap. I was like, oh, same Yes. Yeah. Oh. Ball fabulosity. I know. Ew. She gave better face though, girl. Just saying. No tea, no Sade. She gave better face than you. That's she just, does. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. So, uh, the second house for me was Come Be Golf Song. Mm. Switched it up. Baby, all of them was giving them their film sides, girl. Tonka came out. Ooh, bitch, giving you Auntie Helen, bitch. Auntie Helenisha, bitch. Helenisha. When I tell you that bitch was cute. Tonk, 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 tonk. I was like, big girl, what you gonna do? Go, go, big girl, what you gonna do? Go, big girl, what you gonna do? Go, go, big girl, what you gonna do? <laughs> bitch, I was hitting stomp, stomp, yes. stomp, stomp. Yes. I said, Bitch, eat, eat it, bitch, eat it. Tonka, come the garçon, and we already know Stasha, girl. Yes. Space, grace, beauty, all of that. Mm. But when I tell you they came out and with that switch up, and I was like, Tonka, I mean Tonka, drag. Love <laughs> it. Okay. Ten. Ten tens, ten ten tens, ten tens. Okay, perfect score. <laughs> I didn't understand a Richie this willow. Not this week. I didn't understand a Richie. I was reclamped. I was struggling. I didn't know what was going on. 
what I was watching talented, but I, girl, I'm not gonna give you all that nice shit. I don't know what the fuck y'all was doing, girl. What happened? What what was going on? I'm gonna give you a moment to tell me what was going on. Somebody, tell me what was going on. Oh, what, the time for us to lose? Girl, okay. what happened? How? How did we get here? All right, Deborah what, Cox. What, what, how did we get here? Oh. It was almost like, how? How will they know? They, they, they will know. never know that they you guys know. didn't know what the fuck you was doing. They will never know. How? how? We knew! We knew, girl! We was like, um, so this week we're just going to, like, get out there and just do, like, a smash of shit. And just throw it out there and hope for the best! Okay? Well, girl... This is why I don't go to balls, because I can't be critiqued like this. Girl, I'll be ready to fight, bitch. Sure, what? what you say? You know, don't be talking. Mm -mm. Don't go. Don't mm -mm. go. So, Saifon, tell yeah. me. For over ball, girl, what were your thoughts? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before I switch it over to you, girl, hold on, hold your horses. <laughs> wait a minute. Um, girl, second go category. Hands, baby. Woo, woo. Girl, I was watching them hands and I was like, bitch, get it. So, my favorite two, I'm going to give it back to you, Savon. My favorite two for hand category movements or, you know, woo, all of that, girl. I'm going to give it to you in the boxes because they presented to us boxes this week. Green box and yellow box. Those are my favorite. Period. Poo. Favorite, Boop. that was my favorite, green and Waffle House yellow. Mm-hmm, yes, green and Waffle House yellow. Waffle House yellow. Okay, stay fine, you got it back, girl. <laughs> I'm gonna clip on out. Your turn, girl. Okay, girl, I'm gonna take the screen. So, listen, for me, um, uh, Overball. This show for me was iconic. It was. So, category faves. Um, first category fave. Tichi. I mean, I personally felt like they did the damn thing. You know, they're a house of professional dancers. I mean, so they were doing it all. I mean, I don't know dance like that. I just know dance from people who I have I've been friends with, who are dancers, who does ballet, who does hip-hop, does all that. So if you look at their technique, baby, they are clean and crisp, in my opinion. Now, I'm not a professional, so it's my eye. But in my opinion, they were clean. They went outside their comfort zone. They did the thing. And I loved it. Tichi, duh, I loved it. And you know what? I'm going to give you that. Shannon with that bald head, bitch. Oh, I'm sorry. What they do in the ball? I'm learning so much about balls. Ballroom <laughs> from the show. Yes, I need some nails though to make them clack like that lay on me. Um, but I was like, yeah. Tichi, the house of Tichi constantly raises the bar. You know what I'm saying? Um, Stanley, bitch. I don't agree. With nothing that Meg Nim said, bitch. Um, y'all house eight. Y'all did what y'all was supposed to. In my opinion, you did what needed to be done. Um, there were lots of moves I don't think the judges could do, personally. Not outside of ballroom. I mean, Meg, she can perk, she can bounce, she can do all that, but... The pirouettes, the ballet, the standing on your... You, you couldn't do that shit. This house came through, and they did that. You know what I'm saying? And incorporated ballroom. You felt like they incorporated everything? Okay, it wasn't their best night. However, they have been the best. They have raised the bar. They have shown and made everybody else show up and show out. No disrespect to the other houses. They did it. And if you want to put it on editing, okay, well, they edited to where the house looked like they were constantly coming, going, as, you know, blaming on Quay was like raising that fucking bar. So, 
you know, you have to consider that. And when I think of report cards, when I think of you looking at a categories, you looking at the team, you looking at the competition, you have to look at everything that they brought to the competition. There were several houses. In, we're not going to go there. We're going to wait because, girl, you know, I'm second category fade for me. <laughs> Let me just move on. Um... The boxes, girl, I would have been claustrophobic as fuck. Literally. Like, I wouldn't be able to do it. I, uh, let me out this box. But they were, the, the hand movement was out of this world. And I do like the concept of them putting in boxes so that you really couldn't see. Well, a couple of them, if you remember what they were wearing in their competitions, you knew who it were, who they were. But the movement of their hands. Bitch, eight. Quit sipping like Shaquansha. Ah. Better. Um, <laughs> as I work through my shit on okay. Um, But anyway, I was like, I love it because I feel like you really saw talent then. You didn't have that biased mind of who did it best. You just saw talent. And so, for me, for me, um, oh, no, 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 no. Let me let me pause for a second because Mugler, bitch. Let me go back to the first category because I don't want to walk from this without giving Mugler their props. Father, father Mugler, bitch. When you stepped out as a mother, I said these bitches said we talk. We taking the gloves off. Okay, bitch, uh, fuck what y'all thought, honey. I gagged, literally gagged. He came out and did the damn thing. He took their beard off. They stepped outside their comfort zone. Bitch, talking about the duck turning into a swan. I mean, the how... Mm, yeah, I'm... I'm still gagged! Look, I'm still gagged. If you are watching via YouTube, you can literally see I am still gagged. If you are listening to the podcast, girl... You hear me stumbling. I am still gagged. Okay? So, moving forward to the second category, because I'm sorry, I, I pushed ahead too quickly. Second quarter for me, set, uh, like I said, I would have been claustrophobic. But for me, Shaquansha says that she felt the green box and the yellow box were her faves. Okay? Um, I like the red box and purple. For me. For me. The red box. And the purple. So then when they went through all of that and they got to the final two bottom houses and they chose who they chose and baby, the way Simone, she said, bitch, I'm not leaving this motherfucking stage until I say what I have to say. And here's what I have to say. And when I tell you that Simone read them, read them down, mm. Because if you listen to the other episodes, they talk about you judging the performance, you're judging what they do on on stage right there, the category, the competition. You don't think about the before. I don't necessarily agree with that, but I guess that's ballroom. I'm not, I don't know a lot of ballroom like that. I'm just thinking that when you look at a competition, though, you know, you have to look at and grade on what they brought to the competition. Consistency, quality, all of that. And Jamil stated, like, girl, y'all are the house that has the potential. So I, I, I'm still sitting here stuck on the fact that they went home. But when Simone read them, baby, mm, they shouldn't have been home. And I loved what she did. I felt like Simone had to say what she had to say. You know what I'm saying? Now, Father or Richie, he bowled in that competition. He did the damn thing, and he was better. However, they have been in the bottom house for several times and episodes before that. How you just throw that out the window, I don't get. I do not understand how you just throw all of that logic, all of that out the window, and it's like, They get to go say in the house that pretty much raised the bar each time got to say. But if I, girl, I'm getting heated all over again. The overball was over for me. Okay. I feel like this was some bullshit. And I don't know. 
Listen, y'all, there is a video out there that was released that shows more of the conversation that Simone was having. So you can roll over to YouTube, Instagram, honey. If you need to comment on this video below, girl, I will give you the actual tag name on Instagram where you can go and see the complete video, girl. Well, she read them hoes and read them. She read them. And she should have. You know? And the way they clipped and edited initially, it was like, why is Simone just going off the hook like that? No, baby, when you see the original, you see why she went off the hook. Because she said these houses have done shit, pretty much. Some shit that came out here tonight, and she was talking about this episode, was not worthy of tens, and y'all gave them tens. So we weren't our best. Okay, sometimes you don't always give your best. Everybody on that panel should know because they don't always give their best. It's not a hundred thousand dollars performance. But bitch, they've been performing for a hundred thousand dollars standard the whole season. When Meg said that, I was like, girl, really, Meg? Really, girl? Body yada 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 twerk, 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 girl. Like, okay. If that's the logic, then I need you to switch up your whole brand. Because we've seen it, and as we want to continue to see you excel, because I love Meg, but once again, this is my opinion, then, girl, we need to see more than the twerk, 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 twerk all of that all the time, too. I'm ready to see million-dollar performances. I'm not seeing it. So when you were talking about them having a $100,000 performance over and over, girl, cut... Cut the shit. Cut the shit. Cut the shit. Thank you, Simone, for being you. I still want to be part of House of Tichi, baby. I can serve body and face. Don't give me the dance. My knees is old. I can't do all that. I'm not duck walking for five hours like you did, Simone. However, girl, back to you, Shaquansha, girl. <laughs> I, I've said what I had to say. Bitch, when I tell you Simone read the breaks off Andy. them hoes. And then, so I don't know if y'all saw, as Savon said, bitch, that was an mm. unedited version. Girl, mm. Savon. Mm. Girl. Mm. Like, uh, uh, Look the right way. Girl. When mm. I tell you, when Simone brought her ass right back on stage and was mm. like, and another thing, and last of all, bitch, and y'all hoes done let all these hoes come through, and they ain't did shit, and you done gave them hoes tens, bitch, we was grading on a sliding scale, ho, then y'all gonna sit us, ho. we going home, bitch, and we done raised the bar, we a creme de la creme, bitch, and we going home, this some bullshit, and I agree, I was like, talk your shit, Simone, talk your shit, and then Law sitting over there, and his eunuch, and was like, so when we don't live for you, girl, we don't love you, bitch, you talking about some bullshit, girl. I didn't love this powdered ass wig you got on, but didn't nobody send you home, and they should have sent you home quickly, girl. Okay? Ugh. You and this Barney smile. All them goddamn teeth. Girl, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just had to chime in, girl, because Simone ain't. Simone, when you read them hoes, you ate them, bitch. You ate them up. And then the other judges was chiming. I'm sorry. I wasn't seeing it for Meg either. No, girl. Hush. And if they chop it up, okay, girl. Meg, I wasn't oh. seeing it for you either, girl. Y'all yeah. know y'all was on yeah. some bullshit with that judge mm -hmm. that night. See, this is what happens when you have these um, yeah. creme de la creme groups coming through. They raise the bar, and they may have a night that wasn't, you know, so high oh, having shit. a performance that you like. And then y'all hoes grade mm -hmm. them so harshly when they have done mm -hmm. nothing mm -hmm. but come through. Like Lay, not Naomi, but uh, Jamil said, baby, I'm going to have to go with Tichi because Tichi has the skill set. They have the capabilities to reach heights now. Did father, you know, win the competition? He did. However, when you're looking at the whole score, when you're looking at that report, 
They should not have really? gone home. I oh, am so are? sorry. Oh. No, especially when Arichi was getting those critiques over and over again. Like, no shade to y'all, Arichi, but y'all mm. was getting bad critiques. This should have been one of those things because everybody else was, oh, we're going to give you another chance. We're going to give you another chance. Y'all cut. I feel really like are. even though I know, mm. I know Savon, Titi was your favorite. I didn't put it as my favorite. My yeah, favorite right, was bro. Balenciaga. Which I'm kind of shocked that you didn't choose Balenciaga because, girl, you such a uh, grand boy. I said that once and I'm going to say it again. But, girl, I was shocked yeah. and gagged as yeah. well. Yeah, yeah. I was like, bitch, me and Savon agree. That was some bullshit. Okay. Huh. Wasn't it? Huh. That part. Drink your shit, girl. <laughs> bullshit. For sure. Well, moving on to Ice House. You know, I was like, do I even want to watch it now? <laughs> I know, Savon, you didn't want to watch it, girl, but we had to keep steady. This is about, okay. we love the show. Mm -hmm. So, watching it, Ice House. Um, after the Chi-Chi's left, I'm not mm -hmm. going to lie, the performances became lackluster to me. Um, very yeah. much to me. <laughs> All we saw was more in his teeth. In law and order, order of those teeth, girl. I mean, no shade, girl. I, I got tea, you know. <laughs> but still, bitch, I think is it my cousin on the goddamn tea? But he cousin more. Is it cousin more? Anyway, I'm gonna stop my shit. My favorite house for this episode, girl, because then we gotta go. Because we gotta go. We ain't, I ain't trying to have these long winded no, ass shows like, say bye. Bye, bitch. Don't do too no much. Tea, but my favorite house for Ice House episode was Mooblair and that big ass ball. Bitch, when Father Mooblair, I said, bitch, can you breathe in it? Where's the air? Girl, I know it's hot in there, girl. But when he, I said, bitch. Anytime I see any performances with anybody and they come out in a bubble or a ball, bitch. There, you get my tins. I'm voting for you because bitch presentation is everything. And uh, let's see, Balenciaga, Mugler, and Balenciaga was my favorite two houses of this episode. Category two, um, they did walk. Who were my favorites? Next, oh. moving along. Category three, face. Bitch, you know what it is, Diego. Oh God. Bitch, Diego, the uh, body. Diego, yeah. the body. Gave you face too. I was like, Diego, shit. You was feeling yeah. something. <laughs> I'm single. I'm single. I'm okay, living. Okay, Shabasha. Single. <laughs> I never said I, I was a fucker. And not. So don't but anyway, um, favorite house, Mugler, mm -hmm. Balenciaga. Category. <laughs> Faith, Diego. Those are my choices. If y'all didn't see it, go see it. It's oh. on HBO Max. I'm not going to do all that spoiler alert shit. Go see it. It was cute. I mean, it was cute for the fact that, you know, I felt like the... It, the whole show was lackluster, but I have to pick a favorite, you know. There it is. Paper. Okay, girl. What you think, girl? Well, <laughs> my favorite house, I'm just going to keep that shit real cute and real short, okay? So, my favorite house, none for this episode for the category one. Category two, runway with Mugler. Mugler, Mugler, Mugler. Category face, Comb de Garcon, Stasha Sanchez, point blank, period. She did what needed to be done. Her face was everything. Legendary, in my opinion, she should have gotten it. That's it. That's it, girl. That's it. Back to you, Shaquasha. That's that's it. I'm gonna say. 
Well, I want to thank you guys for joining me tonight, okay, for part two, part two of our review of Legendary Season 2, Season 2. <laughs> Next week, we're going to go through the 9th and the 10th, which is Electric Jungle and Ballroom, which is like the finale, so... I'm going to see what we think. I don't know. I might, because... I'm so over it right now, Brad. Yeah. Mm, mm. Um, but anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode on YouTube. Thank you for listening to the podcast. I hope you were entertained. Please make sure you comment and rate, honey. Let us know if you want to hear me and Miss Savon at it again, girl. Yeah. Reach us at the Savon Experience at gmail.com or if you don't want to talk to her, Dusty Ash, Jaquan Sherrillness at gmail.com. I mean, they Everybody may not want to talk to you, girl. So here we are. Thank you so very much. Ooh, and have a good night. Thank y'all. Bye. Bye.